here with Rusty as far as out from Video Game Heaven. They only ready for this. I don't even know that I'm ready for this. Oh my god, what happened to your head, dude? Just wanted to give a shout out to everybody at Fantastic Nerdum. Welcome to the, to the hardest part of the motherfucking <laughs> ring. All right, so this is better than the best Teron Bishops standing here uh, representing the hardest part of the ring with our favorite diva, Victoria. I ain't the lady to mess with. Woo! Go, 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 go. Yeah. go, 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 and uh, TNA knockout champion, right? Yes, that, how yes. Many times I was five times TNA and two times WWE. Awesome. So, awesome. yes. So, big fan. Thank you. I appreciate you. you taking the time out to speak with us today. Absolutely. Um, so, catch us up. What are you doing currently? Oh, right now, it's my farewell tour. It's my last year wrestling in the ring. I'm still going to do Comic Cons. And my, you know, I'm a geek at heart. So, this is, also, this is pleasure and work for me. Awesome. But more pleasure because... It's cosplay. I mean, it's like animation. Like, it's everything I'm into, right? So this is... And I get to talk to fans at the same time, right? But um, I am going to be transitioning into the medical side. Back... Um, um, believe it or not, this girl had college education. Awesome. And my old my old job was removing corneas, um, eyes, um, heart, bone for transplantation. So I'm going to go back to do probably medical supplies or pharmaceutical sales. That is awesome. It's Isn't that great, fun? Great transition, yeah. too. Yeah. You and I'm give such it a, back. Yeah, and also, like, I'm a people person, so I have to go into sales. Yeah. Our, as a wrestler, we are salespeople. Yeah. We sell ourselves. Yeah. So, yeah. yeah. We definitely sell it. So, um, with the current uh, state of the, the women's wrestling right now, the women's revolution, you are definitely a piece of the backbone and making it happen. How do you feel right now seeing it where it is today? very proud it's like you feel like a mom in the business or a grandma <laughs> in my case um the they're main eventing now which is incredible who would have thunk right um uh, remember lita and trish also yep. main event yep. went to and it was like it's it's growing and um super proud of where women's you know there's a lot of all-female shows now in the indie circuit and there are some i'm doing the indie circuit right now the upcoming talent that are coming through these indies, you guys are gonna be so impressed with how good these wrestlers are. These girls are phenomenal and starting younger and younger every time. So you know? in your opinion, who's the top three right now? Who do I need to look out for? Oh, Who do man. we need to look out for right now? Um, I just wrestled a girl, Hot Scoop Skyler. Um, she was quite amazing. Amazing. Um, oh my gosh, what other indie girls? Um, I'm a, my mind is escaping. There's um, Jessica Havoc is one of my favorites. Um, Madison Eagles is one of my favorites. She's from, uh, yeah, she's in, yeah, overseas. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Um, those are, indeed, there's so many good, talented girls, but, um, yeah, just, it's incredible, incredible. So, hearing that you use your fair wear tour, right, who would you like to wrestle, like, right, if you had a dream match, like, if it's your final match, who would it be? Well, if it was a dream match in my head, I mean, I always want to wrestle China, okay, but God rest her soul. Um, yeah, um, and... <laughs> People are trying to cross the, the, the thing. It's okay. And you know what? I'm going to have to super kick them next time. <laughs> okay, yeah. But, but um, <laughs> that's so funny. Um, okay, wait, wait. What was I saying? No, wait, wait. China was your internet. Oh, yeah, yeah. My dream match. But, like, for my final tour, like, I've been suggesting people, and they are coming through. Like, ODB is one of my favorite opponents. And it was supposed to be also jazz was I was supposed to wrestle. That would have been but amazing. I, oh, God. You know, and she took a job. She got another job. And so I was like, oh, dang, I wanted to go, I wanted to wrestle the girls that I've had experience with, you know what I mean? Just as a farewell, see you later, you know what I mean? Yeah, yeah. Well wishes, that kind of thing. Well, but I'm scared to say retirement because wrestlers are not supposed to say retire, yeah. right? Because right. we always come back. One way or another, right? Yeah. So all you, uh, Beth Phoenix, for example, is yeah. behind a commentating table. Right I know. Now, and it's perfect, right? Yes, you know? right? She adds something to absolutely. the show. Yes, yeah, absolutely. Yeah. Uh, so as I wrap up, I want to ask you... Rookie has to read a script. Yes. Sorry. Yes, Sorry. yes. I'm just so intimidated yeah, yeah, by yeah. the belt, right? <laughs> I don't want him to beat my behind. Um, AEW versus WWE, right? That's oh my God. hot yeah. topic right I now. I just thought got done talking about it to fans. I am I'm a huge Young Bucks fan, um, Cody Hall, all these superstars. Jim Ross is going to there. Yeah. Um, Jericho. Um, 
They sold out their show in four minutes in Vegas. I couldn't even get a ticket. I couldn't even get a ticket. I'm so, you know, but then of course, thank God, I got a, I got a booking on the same weekend. But um, it's finally, you know what I mean? Um, there's going to be room for so many independent wrestlers to have a platform just like WWE, you know, not it's not going to be just WWE or TNA. It's going to be other promotions that can that you know that they can get their foot in the door. Most definitely. You know what I mean? And AEW has health insurance. They That's got the wrestlers' deal. health insurance. Mind blowing, you guys. Mind blowing. Yeah. So, um, who do you think are gonna win? What, on what the ladder? AEW. Oh wait, A-A-W. I don't. I can't say no. You know, WWE has a lot of years of experience, and they're very loyal fans. Yeah. You know, but it's. I'm not saying which one's better or not. They're. It's just a better platform, and hopefully, it's a different. You know, roster. You know what I mean. But it gives young talent somewhere else to go. Cool. Awesome. Well, I like to thank you for thank taking you. time to speak with us. We know you're not the lady to mess with. Woo! Yep. So we appreciate you. <laughs> Thank right. you. Um, Thank you. And we we'll appreciate your time again. Thank you. Oh, thanks. I Here, appreciate it. You guys want to get a close up? And a fan made this for me. It's not the original. A fan made it for it. See, so a big shout out to all my fans. The love and support you give me. I love you guys.